What it do YouTube? It's your boy Rising E here and today I'm back here with another video. Alright guys, shoot, the topic of this discussion is what is really retirement? So in this system, you if you haven't haven't noticed or not, whatever, that you literally are basically working for a career. And then for that career, you're gonna spend most of your time there. You like basically most of your time. 85% of your time there. Way more than you spend your time with your kids, with your family. It's crazy though that it's it's crazy, but in it's sad at the same time that the people that you work with know you way more than they know their own family members. That's that's not a good sign at all. That shows you that we got distant as fuck. Like, really distant. I mean, I would, I don't mind. Like, I would talk to my family members, but all the time, they just, they be trying to, trying to tell me nonsense. Like, when they talk about nonsense, I'm like, stuff that I already figured out, like, three years ago. I'm past that. Like, and they talking about responsibility and bills. Like, it's literally just saving fucking illusion money. Like, that shit is not fucking hard. It just don't spend shit and just keep flipping. That's literally what I learned from the system is literally don't spend shit and keep flipping your money. And you will literally be rich in five in five years, no matter what job you go to. If you flip all your bread for the five years and eating some straight bullshit, you've been driving some straight bullshit, you've been slaving, you literally could do that shit. But going back to the topic, like, so... You go to school, whatever, and then you start working, or whatever. You get you you start liking this career a little bit, I guess. I mean, not a lot of people like their careers at all. To be one hundred, my mom was a prime example. Just because, I I literally was there to see her like, shit, bring put out all her anger out on me, and then I I understand it, because like. Just cause like I, if you don't want to go somewhere, you don't, and you ha you force to go somewhere, but you don't want to do it. Like you gonna be angry every day, and that's why I never got mad at her. Like I told her, like I don't like you yelling at me, but it don't. I I didn't just say it, like just being rude and disrespectful. It's like nah, like I'm a person you're supposed to talk to. You feel me? Cause you, I came out of you, nigga. <laughs> so I'm I'm supposed to be the person you talk to. Like you know, yell at me. I'm supposed to be there for you, regardless. Of any situation. But, like, yeah, when I... See, I just seen her coming home, stressed the fuck out and shit. That shit's just, like, damn. And then people... And it, I don't even know how, but, like... I If I if that happened in my house, so I imagine what happened in other people's households when their parents were stressed the fuck out from work and shit. Because my mom literally said she hated work. It's, like, the same thing when I said I literally hated going to school. She hated going to work. We had the same, we think alike. It's just that we just on different frequencies. It's, it's crazy. But like, whatever, because most of your peoples now are retired. So this is why I started talking about my mother and stuff. So you see how they retire and stuff? You see they more energetic. They want to do more things. They want to hang out with you more and stuff like that. That's just, that's common things. Because they trying to get back the time that they wasted trying to provide for you in this bullshit illusion system. That's literally why they trying to do that. But, so when you, when you finally retire, you finally, this is what happens when you finally retire. When you finally retire, you get a little bit of freedom. <laughs> You get a, a little bit of real freedom. The reason why I said that, you don't have to um go to work. You don't have to go to school. You're done. You literally just kick back and relaxing. But the thing is that people don't notice is that the government still own you. Like, they send you checks and shit. So they, whenever, whenever they decide, oh, I don't want to send a check, you fucking hit. This is what this is what retirement really does. Retirement gives you freedom, but then they want you to rely more on them. If you rely more on them, that's when they still got you again. Because you can't be misbehaving. You can't be doing all this other extra bullshit or whatever. All this and that. Like I could bring up another example. Insurance, like, you you literally have to be freaking healthy as fuck to get 
what you pay for for real. And that's and when I talk about pay for for real, like at least sixty percent of what you pay for, at most. That's what I learned from insurance. So imagine the older folks, right? That literally been stressing their whole life, working their whole life, having all these mental issues, back problems, joint problems, all that shit. And some of them that even smoked, that ain't, like, bro, all them guidelines I said, like, you, these guidelines you have to pass to get insurance in this world is so ridiculous. It's like, bro, you will literally fail. Like, you will literally get declined. You can't, it's hard to get accepted. Especially if you smoke weed. And smoke weed and smoking weed literally literally numbs most of the fucking chemicals that that you put in your body from all the foods and drink foods that you drink on a consistent basis. That's literally what weed does. All these detox cleansing, all that fruits and vegetables, that's all it does is clean this shit. But at the same time, bro. It's just like when you when you retire, bro. It's really no benefit because you don't you're not getting no type of income. Which is like I wouldn't care about income anyway. If I retire, I would have moved. If that was me, I would have moved out of the country. But not most people do that. They don't think like that. They don't want to do that. But like you lose income, you gotta rely on an entity that is really a corporation that's really there just to improve themselves instead of not the whole if our the whole community. Just themselves. Like, you're not going to win. And the fact alone is that I say you got more freedom. It's not really still freedom. You're relying on them. Freedom is really you worried about yourself only and your family. And you get to do whatever you want with no consequence and no judgment. And I'm not talking about you doing some straight wild evil shit. You feel me? Just chilling. Just chilling, chilling and creating, bro. That's literally what I would be doing or if I was retired. I would literally just be chilling and building, creating. Probably smack. I don't know. It might be some that could keep my my attention span. You feel me? There's always some out there. But yeah. Basically what I'm saying is that. What things that seem like that's good in this world is still not good at all. It's really not. Like, it's, they, it's so deceiving, bro. And the crazy thing about it, when insurance and shit, like, when you, when you take a job like that, you realize how much they be finessing, like, on a daily basis. On a daily basis, bro. Low accepting rates. People that actually need the insurance can't get it, bro. Just because of their health problems. But you get insurance because of your health. Like, how? how? You you have health problems, but you can't get health insurance because you don't fit the guidelines that of being healthy. That they can represent you and take care of you. That don't even make sense, bro. And then the fact alone is that you feeding people poison to help them be like that. I can't sit here and just just sit here and just not talk about it. Y'all getting fed fucking straight poison. Well, it's, it's it's not a difference from a, a a snake a snake biting you. I said snake, a snake biting you, bro. With all their poison and all them venom in their veins and their teeth and stuff, like that's literally what we eating. And your body literally gets used to that shit. Watch when you stop eating that shit, bro. You you feel. You just feel more realer. Like you feel you don't feel fake. You don't feel processed. That's just with me. I mean, I know most of the fruits and vegetables are tampered with anyway. But you will still get the your nutrients and stuff from it just because you can't you can't take out the main quality of a of, of natural of natural foods. You can't take the main quality of something natural. It's impossible. Like they try to limit most of my people. And make us look like we dumb. We have natural intelligence. They have AI intelligence. You can't stop that shit. I don't care how ignorant our people is. We were really fucking smart as shit. Y'all just ignorant as fuck. But yeah, man. Retirement, bro. 
it seems lavishly with what they say in the papers or whatever, what they ever say. But at the same time, if you want to think about it like this, bro, they still got you. If you still here, if you still live in America, they still got you. If they still got your IDs, their social security numbers, all that, they still got you. You got to literally leave the system. Rising here, peace.